How's it going guys? This is Eric with the Rain Survival and today I'm going to do a review on a poncho. I actually received this poncho from a company. Uh, I got it for free and they asked me to do a review on it and I said sure, why not? So here's the casing that it comes in. There's the company name there and it's basically, it's got a tie down on the top and that's it there. It's just a it's pretty much a waterproof bag. Um, I don't really like it in the bag. It's Sometimes it's a little bit difficult to pull it out, but I'm probably gonna use this bag for something else because I can store material in here and keep it relatively dry. So I'm gonna save this bag, and it's very easy to see. It's orange, obviously. So if I'm looking for it, I can pull it out of my bag, no problem. So I'm probably gonna use this for something else. So, it's a poncho here. And it's orange, of course. Great material for signaling. And let me show you the full size here. So it's the size. It's a pretty large poncho. It's got a nice hood on the top here. It's got uh, straps to singe it down. So you can basically singe it down around your head. I'll put it on in just a second. And one feature I like is it has grommet holes on the corner. And it's actually got pretty nice stitching. I was surprised. Uh, it's basically double stitching. There's a layer here and a layer here. And it's got a small grommet hole. You can put like power cord or something through it to string up a ridge line and make an emergency shelter. And uh, it's got double stitching on the edge there, like I said. Uh, it's a fairly large poncho. And this one has a feature I've actually never seen before. So on the sides here, to basically uh, close it tight, there's Velcro. And you got Velcro on, the, on this side here. And then I thought it was a de design flaw at first, but this side has a piece of Velcro and there's no Velcro on the opposite side. But then I realized, well, if I took this off and I attached it to here, what would the purpose be for that? And then I realized on the front, it's smaller as opposed to the back. So if you have a big backpack on, you can throw it, uh, singe it together right here and you can throw it over your back. So sorry if the mic's a little bit crinkly here. But uh, the, the hood basically is really tight on your head. It's going to basically repel any rain that comes down on you. And like I said on the side, if you Velcro it at the top, the front end of your poncho comes down to about your knees, but the back end drapes down a little bit more. And the reason for that is if you have a large backpack on, you know, it's going to give you a good surface area to stay dry. And uh, I had another poncho similar to this one, and I used it pretty frequently. But I noticed that sometimes when I have my big backpack on, the back end of my legs and my feet get wet pretty frequently. So it's a cool, cool little feature I've never seen before. And uh, if you're interested in this poncho, I'll put the link in my description. Uh, it is nice and bright and orange, so you can see me for miles, especially in the winter when there's no leaves on the trees. But it's a great piece of gear to have. I definitely always carry a poncho with me on every trip, even if I'm just going out for a day hike. You know, you never know what's going to happen with the weather. The weather channel isn't always correct, and it's good to have protection from the rain, especially when I have camera equipment. And uh, it's very crucial. And uh, I usually use the poncho. I'll pull it out, throw it on the ground, and keep my gear dry. Or if I'm bringing the dog, I'll throw it on the ground, and she'll lay on that as opposed to the, the damp ground. So a poncho is an awesome piece of kit to have. I'm sure most of you know that. And uh, if you're interested in this one, I believe it's about 16 bucks. It's pretty high quality. Uh, you can see the stitching on this. It's very fine stitching. I don't know how well you can see with the camera there, but it's really small square stitching, and uh, it's, it's pretty durable. And I was a little skeptical. You know, someone sending me free gear. You know, what the heck's going on here? But it's a, it's a pretty nice piece of kit, and I'm definitely going to keep this one in my bag. Uh, I'm actually, I have two of them now, so I'm... If someone else comes out with me, I'll let them use this one. Uh, it comes in a different color as well. I forget which color. But uh, you, you can check out the link in the description. So that's it. I'm the big orange thing in the woods. And this is my poncho. Thanks, guys. I'll see you on the next one. Yeah!